Hey, what is up everyone? This is Linus and I just came back from the day two at IFA Berlin and there were quite a few press conferences and one of the most interesting was held by the ZTE and in that conference they presented the ZTE Accent 7 Mini which is a pretty similar phone to the uh, ZTE Accent 7 but it's smaller but it sports a very similar design language. For example, it's also made out of metal it has rounded corners, rounded edges, and it's pretty comfortable to hold with the hand. So the thing is that it is smaller because it has 5.2 inches 1080p AMOLED screen, and which is pretty sharp and vibrant, and I would say it's a pretty similar panel to the one found on the ZTE Accent 7. ZTE spent quite a lot of time talking about the audio experience on the ZTE Accent 7 Mini. In fact, it carries all the same hi-fi chips, Dolby Atmos surround system and all other great features that we know about the ZTE Accent 7. So it has the front firing speakers and a great audio experience via the headset jack. As far as the specs go, we are looking at a pretty much mid-range level smartphone. It's for a Snapdragon 617 chip, 3 gigabytes of RAM and 32 gigs of storage, which can be further expanded via the micro SD card slot. As far as cameras go, we have a 16 megapixel shooter on the back, which has f1.9 aperture and 8 megapixel shooter with f2.2 aperture on the front. All right, so. The, one of the most interesting parts of this device is, of course, the pricing. Uh, as we know, the ZT Accent 7 costs almost 400 euros in Europe or $400 in the United States. And the Accent Mini costs 299, 299 US dollars or 299 euros, which is a pretty damn amazing considering the whole package you're getting, all the specifications, cameras, the build quality, hi-fi audio experience, I think it's a pretty compelling offering. All right, so as far as availability, it will be available for purchase on September 7th in the US, in some major EU countries like Germany, Spain. Also, it will be available in India, Japan, Australia, and the availability will expand a little bit later. So it's pretty cool that they just announced the device and it will be available for purchase quite soon. All right, so that would be it for this video, just a short hands-on video. And I hope to get the ZT Accent 7 Mini for a review as soon as possible. And I'll try to make the review as soon as possible once I get the device. All right, so thanks for watching. See you in the next video soon.